now I want to head over to high school hoops. Um, I just want to talk about a few players that I feel like that are under the radar and deserve a little bit more credit because, you know, they've they, they been improving. I've I seen the improvement of these three guys over the years. And uh, they might not be on the national platform right now, but trust me, they will be. And that is James Jones Jr., Ramir Barno, and Justin Edwards. All three played for Team Final, uh, 15U squad. First, I would like to get into James Jones Jr. I've been watching him play basketball for a while now. He's played with Team Final, middle school team, with DJ Wagner, Sebastian, Sion, Boog, and the rest of them guys. His game has improved so much, so much. He's become a way better scorer. He, he he can score from anywhere in the court. You know, he can knock down a three ball. He can pull up to the mid range, drive to the basket. He can now dunk. I seen him dunk a few times in the Jado Films runs. Um, he he's a he he's he's improving at a, a fast rate. You know, he recently transferred to Spire Institute Academy. Uh, that's a good fit You know He's going to get a lot more looks Now that he's at a, a higher performance school He came from West Catholic uh, James Jones Jr. Stock will be rising In the next few years uh, So be on the watch out for that kid I love that kid I love his game Offense He's very skilled He's an offensive wizard um, And now I want to talk about Ramir Barno In my opinion He's the quickest most electrifying guard in the class of 2023 besides dj wagner i believe dj wagner is the quickest and guard but i believe right after that is ramir barno i don't see another guard that's quicker than ramir barno in the philadelphia new jersey new york area and he can score i remember watching him back in middle school when he was playing with philly triple threat he got a lot taller he got more confident he stepped into a starting role at emotep this year as a freshman he seems like he really got his confidence up as a player. He can knock down shots. Oh, his handle is crazy. I see him cross up guys. He can do the step back shot. Oh, I, he got the Ja Moran hairstyle now. He he looks great as a, a freshman. And he got three years to go. He's only going to get better. In my opinion, I believe he's going to be a top 10 guard in the class regardless of height. Because th that's the thing that kind of held him back uh, in his middle school days. He was kind of short. But he's getting a lot taller now. And he really knows how to use his body, his shiftiness to get to where he needs to be on the court. To make a layup, to make a shot. He He's a great guard. And I just can't wait to, to see his improvement over the next three years at Emotep. And the last player I want to talk about is a 6'6 big guard, Justin Edwards. Man, I watched this kid play. He's phenomenal. Like, he's explosive. He can shoot. He can take you off the dribble, dunk. But what stood out to me was his handle. Oh, my God. Ooh-wee. I see him cross up a lot of folks. And you don't really see people with that height, with that handle. It's like it's like a street ball kind of handle, almost like an and one. You know, you think he's going left, but he goes right. You think he's going right, he goes left. You know, he think he's going left. He might go back to a step back. His his handle is ridiculous. That's what really that's what really separates him from the rest. You know, he can dribble very good for his height. Very good. He's six six and can dribble like a like a six two guard almost. And I just love his game. He pits on a little bit more weight, and and he's going to be on the national stage. Like this kid is the real deal. And I just can't wait to see all of these kids. Uh, progress and improvement throughout the next three years I can't wait to see it and I can't wait to see them on the EYBL platform you know this year COVID kind of messed things up so they couldn't really play but next year I believe they'll be one of the top 16 U teams on the EYBL unit I just can't wait to see it